looking to buy a French villa in Copperleaf Golf Estate. Good afternoon. This is Xavier with Luxury Homes Johannesburg. Today we are back in one of my favorite estates together with tour guide Victoria from Barack Real Estate who's going to take us on a tour of this gorgeous home behind us. As always, specs on the house. This is a four bedroom, four and a half bathroom, four garage home. Guys, you're going to like this one. Off we go. Thank you, Xavier. Hi everyone and thank you once again for joining me here today. I am extremely excited to show you this character filled home. I love it when we come across these rare gems and I'm really excited to show you. Come on through. Xavier, as you walk into the household, you'll see and something you will notice throughout this entire house are these spectacular thick wooden beams that run throughout the house. I'll be pointing them out as we go, but really just building character in the home. Walking into this massive open double volume entrance way, you can see those beautiful chandeliers um, and the stunning wooden staircase. I must say something about this house is that it's extremely character filled, very different. A lot of energy and time has gone into the design of the home and it's so lovely to see these houses when they're different and they're full of character. Coming through this way, we'll be walking into the main living area, which you can see is absolutely spectacular. Just looking out there into the garden. And we'll have a walk through here to the kitchen and touch on the kitchen. How beautiful are these rustic bricked archways? Just really um, embodying French Provence style. And then coming into this kitchen, Xavier, what do you think? Gorgeous. Oh, this house, guys. I talk about character fold. I talk about aspects of the home. I mean, if you look up, we've got these beautiful timber beams running through. It really makes you feel like you're in the French countryside. You've got this stunning kitchen, beautiful, massive wooden island. We've got the butler's sink, gas appliances, quartz tops, the white shake profile. And then if you turn around, Xavier, you will see that this house actually has Originally, it was built on to be an internal freezer room. So at the moment, this room is literally just got massive freezers in it, you know, for people who have massive big families, big into hunting, that kind of thing. You can store your meat there. And then we've got space for your general, like everyday single door fridge in your kitchen, you know, just for your everyday goods. To the right hand side, we have this beautiful little bar area that you can have here off your dining room. And then coming in here, massive, massive scullery, I mean, you really don't need anything more. We've got space for two many appliances in here. I think you could probably fit six machines. And then looking out onto your beautiful outside entertainment area. Interesting, I bet from an entertainment point of view as well, to pass the food through. Right, and yep. all your dirty dishes, that kind of thing outside if you're brying. So well thought out, so beautiful. Again, these beautiful beams can't get over them and then we're just gonna pop outside and have a quick look at the entertainment area we've got a beautiful summer's day here the Sun is shining and this stand is um, particularly big for copper leaf um, if I stand to be corrected it's about 1,500 squares so really beautiful you know you've got ample space ample garden we've got the different leveled um, garden over here beautiful pool and it looks out onto a green belt but there's a beautiful dam and everything out front as well absolutely stunning you mentioned earlier the stand is much larger than most of the stands here in Copperleaf it, it plus is. you're in a cul-de-sac it is so being benefit of being at the end of a cul-de-sac is you don't have 700 cars driving past you every day which is so lovely so yeah can you picture having your entire family all your friends here in this massive beautiful entertaining area you really couldn't ask for anything more it's beautiful Gorgeous. absolutely stunning aluminium um, doors and windows throughout vinyl flooring throughout really well maintained beautiful kept clean well decorated I mean we can't fault it absolutely mm -hmm. can't fault it my little eye spotted something oh, next door oh yeah. did it we'll have to like yes. pop in on the way back down <laughs> right now what we're going to be doing is we're going to be going upstairs to show you the main living areas upstairs always a nice to have in a home is your pajama lounge which is so nice and then 
we'll be walking through this way into the main bedroom, guys. Massive. How beautiful. It's so well decorated, so modern, but also like super quirky and beautiful. And I just love the little details, like those beautiful lights hanging next to the bed. And um, coming out onto a beautiful patio. Look at your beautiful garden. The silence of being on the green belt. You can yeah. see the golf course, but it's lovely. You're not anywhere near the golf course, so you don't have to worry about getting hit with balls and all the rest. It's just behind the green belt, like you said. <sighs> wow. It's so lovely. Like I can just hear the water flowing from the pool, really creating like a sense of tranquility and ambiance. Look at you, I almost feel bad for talking. It's I so know, quiet in here. it's so quiet, it's so lovely. We've also got an outdoor shower, which is super cool, as well as doors leading into the bathroom, which we'll show you from the other way around. Coming back through, we'll walk into the massive ensuite. So I love this ensuite because A, you've got a huge bath, you got your separate toilet with a glass frosted door, which is amazing got storage in the bathroom for towels that kind of thing and then you've got a his and hers sink and vanity amazing so you can't complain if somebody's making your side dirty or the rest <laughs> needing their toothbrushes and their hairbrushes everywhere and then a double his and hers shower that leads straight outside how cool very nice i like the fact that it's nicely symmetrical I look know. at this you got one here. And then you got one there. And then you got one there. And you've got the benches as well, so you know you can sit, sh shave, do all those weird and wonderful things. <laughs> and then coming back through here, um, we walk into the very large walk-in closet, which ample space for all your beautiful clothing. And then drawers, shoe space. Oh, it's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. As for the house itself, really well maintained, very clean. Everything's done really well. You know, you can see that they've really looked after this home. And it's turnkey, really. You'll move in perfect. Everything's ready to rumble. Um, over here, we'll be walking into the second bedroom upstairs. This bedroom is also ensuite. Again, extremely ample in size. Um, that beautiful window above the bed, I love that, just letting light into the, into the room. And then we've got lots of built-in cabinetry. And then um, a beautiful ensuite bathroom with vanity, toilet and shower. Perfect. As we walk back out onto the pajama lounge, we come into the third and final room upstairs again, passing all this beautiful dark wood cabinetry. And again, another really nice sized room, carpeted throughout, beautifully decorated. To the left hand side, we have its ensuite bathroom. Let's have a peek inside. Mm -hmm. Here we have another storage room, which is really nice for like big bags and that kind of thing. And then this also will walk out onto its own um, little patio veranda and then you actually that other bedroom has access as well onto the same side which is really nice okay let's make a walk back down the stairs to show you the rest of this amazing home because that's what it is especially for this price i was quite surprised so well priced i won't yeah. I, I i mean you and i both looked at the price before when we we're going over the specs and we were like quite impressed and now having seen the inside. Yeah, and then you see the inside and you think, oh, wow. I'm obsessed with those lights. I think they're so cool. They're beautiful. Like, like I said, this house has very much a, a feel of like very art deco, like it's got tons of character. It's so beautiful. It's not just your general like cookie cutter home. Coming back through this way, this is the, I want to say TV lounge. Beautiful TV lounge. We got a wood burning fireplace in here. Built in integrated um, entertainment systems. You got the speakers running throughout the, uh, throughout the home and in the roofs and all the rest. And then something you mentioned earlier as we walked by that you caught out of the corner of your eye. You got a beautiful wine cellar. Look at this, guys. Look at that. 
And I love this. Look how know. awesome this is. Nice it's little beautiful. gate closing up. There you go, with the fridge. Absolutely stunning. Walking back through our signature beautiful bricked up um, arches, which I'm just obsessed with. Uh, we'll pass, there's a guest toilet to the left hand side here. All out looking onto again, ample space, ample beautiful, well manicured gardens. And it really just always incorporating the outside with the inside, really making you feel like you're in a little wine farm in France. Hey, look at there, they've got a vegetable garden, there's got all the chilies and the um, basil and rosemary. You can just walk out the store, go get some stuff for your kitchen. Like we mentioned earlier, there's definitely somebody here with green fingers. Definitely, definitely. This type of garden. Yeah. <laughs> um, so this is the fourth bedroom situated downstairs. Beautiful, ample in size. Built-in cabinetry, it's got its own ensuite. Well, I'll explain the bathroom to you now. So yes, it is um, situated just outside this bedroom, but there is a door separating it from the rest of the house. So it can be shared with the bedroom next door. Um, but yeah, very nice sized bedroom. Beautiful windows again, looking out onto your stunning garden, which almost seems like it's in a different country. Oh, by the bush. It's really tranquil, I can't get over it. I wanna come stay here. <laughs> Walking back through this way, what we'll do is we'll, um, we're gonna be stopping in on what they are currently using as their office, but it can be used as a fifth bedroom because as mentioned, it could share this bathroom with this bedroom that we just walked into. They're currently using it as an office and I think um, an office is always a good thing to have especially with the fact that the house already has four bedrooms with ensuite bathrooms. But it's just good to know in case you're needing that extra space. And downstairs might be used, the one we just saw, as a guest or exactly. potentially an extra kid. Exactly, there you go. And then walking back out into the beautiful entertainment area, which I really think is like the star of this home. The garden is just so spectacular, the pool is so spectacular and the stand itself guys um the stand is an absolute winner we're gonna have a quick look at the outside um bry area so what we have is we have a charcoal built in bry you've got your prep sink you have your cabinetry and you've got your space for your bar fridge and your appliances outside as mentioned earlier you said how cool is it to have that window that goes into the scullery so if you're entertaining you can just kind of send all your dishes and everything straight in there without having to walk all the way around into your kitchen. Absolutely beautiful. Let me catch you off guard. Yes. What's that called again? Oh. Um, a butler's window. That's a good guess. I can't remember what it was. That's I can't why. remember. I'm sure it was a butler's window, wasn't was it? it? No, I can't remember. Guys, um, anyone remember what it was called? I can't remember. <laughs> Just a few extra things yeah. to talk about on the house is it has integrated an integrated vacuum system. It's got four garages. It has a domestic quarters. It has extra storage, um, an extra garden shed storage area within the garage. So guys, this house is definitely worth a look and I really um, appreciate you joining us here today. And yeah, enjoy. Guys, what do you think? This is your access to your green belt. I feel horrible for talking. I say it again. The bird life is amazing. These are not sound effects. It's beautiful. <laughs> there you go. There you have the house. Beautiful French villa in Copperleaf Golf Estate. If you have any questions, make sure to reach out. The agent's details, phone number are below. And as always, if you like this video, make sure to click on any of the two that I've presented here in front of you. There are other tours that I've done in Copperleaf together with Victoria that you might like. Guys, thank you for taking the time to watch this video and have an awesome, awesome afternoon.